Hello, truth seekers. Oh my gosh, what a week. I hope yours was awesome. But God called me to go deep with him this week. Get on my knees and spend some serious time with him. The speaking stuff is cranking up. Travel is going to be nuts. It's wonderful. I am so blessed. There is no way that I'm, you know, bumming about it. But I do know that it's going to be not my regular routine to be on you know the road and and doing the parish missions and prayer breakfasts and retreats and it's awesome awesome but he called me this week to be with him and this morning as we were praying he said why haven't you shared your 40-day prayer prayer course your video thing and i'm like well because it's just going to get lost in all the lent stuff and quite frankly I have been really trying to get people to do this with me this Lent, which is Mary's Mantle Consecration. This is about working on virtues and the gifts of the Holy Spirit, and I think it's a wonderful thing. It'll start on Ash Wednesday, and it will end on Holy Saturday, and I'm actually going and doing it with the folks at Holy Cross in Batavia. So if you're local in the Illinois-ish area, <laughs> come on over from Iowa, come on down from Wisconsin. Um, I'll be kicking it off on Sunday, February 23rd at 6.30 at the parish. We're going to have wine and some snacks, and we're just going to bond as a community, people at the parish. But I'm also doing this online, as I've mentioned, in my Facebook community. I've put the link here. And that's going to be, you know, available to everybody. You don't have to get the books, although I'd recommend it. And I think it'd be great to support Christine. Uh, Christine Watkins is my Radio Maria co-host, for those of you who are just checking this out for the first time. And I apologize. I put a, I put a video on YouTube that says some of this stuff last week. I know you get this on Monday morning, but I posted it on Thursday. Anyway, what I'm basically saying is God told me, get out there and share how to pray because I did not know how to pray. People come up to me all the time on social, in email, after I'm done with a talk and they're like, how, do, how did you build your prayer life? How, how do I pray? And it's so difficult because you can't just tell someone after a talk in a small conversation while you're signing books and stuff. It's a individual, unique journey that you alone will have with God. But I share some of the things that I learned because I had no idea what prayer was. I just thought prayer was saying the Our Father, the Hail Mary. I honestly didn't even know what the Glory Be was. And I also thought it was just time to go to God and ask him for stuff. <laughs> I had no idea about this beautiful love affair, this excitement and joy and peace and the Holy Spirit just lighting and igniting a fire in your heart and you getting out there and spreading it with the world. That's what I'm doing here. This is my mission to help others deepen their relationship with God and the beautiful Catholic faith. So yes, the prayer course is rooted in Catholicism. But I know for a fact that some of you who are receiving these truth seeker videos are not Catholic and have gone through the program yourself. And I know that there are other people who are not even Christian who have gone through the program as well. So I'm putting one link here that you should download, and that is the free prayer guide. And the free prayer guide is, and I don't know if I, oh, I do still have it up. Wait. Okay is a lot of information. So it's got your table of, oh, your table of contents, you know, a little welcome thing, couple of prayers. It gets, you know, I believe in miracles. It puts the miracle prayer. This is a little story about the Father Rookie miracle cards that I received. Puts the miracle prayer right in front of you that you could pray every day. And then of course we get into specific stuff, right? There's the beautiful poem by um, Saint Teresa, Mother Teresa. And then we get into things like finances and sickness and illness. And it gets into 
worry and stress and Bible quotes. Then it gets into um, the nine day novena of surrendering to God. It is jam packed. Thank you, Angie, for all your help with that. She helped design it. I like put the content there. But at the very least, download that for yourself and send it off to other people that need to be praying immediately for things like illness, um, financial issues, death in the family. Maybe you're just overwhelmed with stress and anxiety and worry. And that's all in this, it's like 20 pages long. So at the very least, download that. The second thing I want you to check out, which is what God told me to get out there and share, is my video prayer program. It's never going to expire, and it is not a Lenten prayer program. So if you want to do it now or sign up for it now and then do it later after Lent, go for it. If you want to save the link and get it later too, that's fine, but it never expires. It will always be there. And what is this thing that I'm talking about? It's basically going to walk you through the things that I learned about how to pray and all of the beautiful sacramental graces and resources in the Catholic Church to help you along on your journey. So it has a weekly theme and every day has a focus and then it builds the next week and it builds the next week. And it's 40 days, not because it should be done during Lent, but feel free to do that. But I don't know about you, I would wanna go like diving deep and going deep with prayer, love, and grace. That's the title of the prayer course, 40 days of prayer, love, and grace. And get on it, I mean, get on it now. When God said, I, I need you to get on your knees and spend some time with me, I fought it, yeah, but I got these videos to do, I got all this other stuff to do, I gotta finalize some of my trips, I gotta work on some of my presentations, blah, blah. yeah, uh-uh, get on your knees. And it's been beautiful. So when, again, he told me to share this, I wanna say that I chose 40 days when I prayed on this because I kept saying, God, people are so desperate to, to have a relationship with you and they don't know how. And I've taken prayer courses that I have been kind of feeling all by myself. It's just me and the video or the documentation that they give me. And you know, if I miss a day or it expires on me and I'm kind of like, well, there it goes. I don't have that anymore. That's not what I wanted. So when I prayed through this, this was the outcome. First, walk with you. I don't just want to shove a bunch of stuff at your face. I want to walk with you every morning, just like these videos, you get one from me, but they're only three minutes. <laughs> they're not these blah, 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 blah ones that you get every week. And they are um, poignant to the topic and they're honest. I share some of my own struggles with prayer and how to really understand this whole Catholic faith and what are the saints and what's Mary all about and the rosary and why should I care, all of that. And by the end of the 40 days, I'm promising you, although I can't measure it like a weight loss program, you will feel differently. You'll have graces poured in your life. You will put a structure in place and it's made for busy people. It's a 15 minute a day deal. There's a, a PDF file that you look at and you focus on one thing a day. I'm not asking for the world here, but I am asking you to really think about your prayer life and to make a commitment and try it out. I mean, at the very least, I do give a money back guarantee. If you're not happy with it, come back to me and we'll give you your, I will, there's only me in this thing. <laughs> I'll give you your money back. It's not, you know, it's not about the money. As a matter of fact, the link that I have here is the discounted version for you. It's, um, it was $40 a day, $40 a day, $40 total, a dollar a day. And so I've discounted it if you download the program and then please share it, not the program, the prayer guide. So if you download the prayer guide, you get the link at the bottom of that prayer guide email, it'll say, do you want to go deeper with God? And if the answer is yes, together, 
just click that box and check out the prayer course. You've got a couple of samples and you can see the PDF file and you can make your choice from there. No pressure. As a matter of fact, I hadn't even gone out to talk about it because I didn't want it to be about me. But I know that my whole mission is to help others deepen their relationship with God and the Catholic faith. That is my one line mission. So why wouldn't I share it? Again, it's not about me. It's about you and deepening your relationship with God with a little help and a friend along the journey. Not to mention you are out there with all these other people who are taking the course either with you or before you. So all of their comments and additional resources, maybe links, maybe tips or tricks for that particular topic or that focus of the day are there. So you're not just getting my way and there's many ways to pray. You're getting other people's comments and thoughts about that day's focus and links to other resources and books and it's it's awesome and that was the difference that's why i said god i don't want to do something that's that i've done where i felt like all on my own and the minute i miss a day i'm done this isn't a 40 day you do it in lent this is 40 days because 40 days is a biblical number and it also means that you will be able to instill a habit and be able to get used to praying on a daily basis and starting your day with Jesus. Because when I wake up, I cannot wait to start my prayer life. And that is what I want with you. And as you know, prayer isn't just one time during the day. You begin to thank God and praise God and, and start incessantly praying, which is living life with God and the Holy Spirit within you, asking him all day, every day. And so when, when I was in prayer, it was, it's Thursday that I was in prayer, and he said, why haven't you shared this? I mean, it came out of the blue. So yeah, I did a video on Thursday, and I got it out there. And so here's the video on Monday to you truth seekers. If you're subscribed to my YouTube channel, you got both. Sorry, it's kind of a redundant message. But download the 40-day prayer program prayer guide, sorry, then click the box at the very bottom saying, yes, I want to check this out. I want to go deeper and see what that's all about. You'll still get the download, the free download, but you'll be able to go to the discounted prayer program page and then check it all out. See what it's about. Watch a few videos and look at the PDF. See if it's for you. And then last but not least, for Lent, which is a specific number of days here, this is the Mary's Mantle Consecration, the workbook and the little book. You can get it on Queen of Peace Media or Amazon, that'll work too. It's probably less um, effort for Christine if you go to Amazon. But also Ooh. click the, oh, I did not mute that, sorry everyone click the link for the Facebook community and join me. I will be taking photographs of each of the days and putting it out there and it'll you just follow along day by day. If you join the group, you get a little notification on your smartphone saying, hey, there's a new post and you can check it out and we could all work on being better people. We all need to live more virtuous lives and who better to do it with than our mother Mary and our lady of Guadalupe who was the one who honestly changed my life when she healed me from my marijuana addiction. It's a big one today. Okay, I love you all. Pray for me as I hit the road and I get in front of people over these next, I don't know, six, eight weeks. I am really excited. I'm going to share with you in this video or in the email, it, it'll be a long one, but it'll, it'll be chock filled with information, but I'm going to share with you where I will be. Maybe you will be in that area and have no idea that I'm going to be there. I would love to meet you. And also you could share the um, locations and dates and, and topics with other people. Let's say you know someone that's close to Charles or to Iowa and it's not you, but it's your sister, so you can send it along, and I'm all about that. Of course, if you have any 
thoughts or ideas of places that I could come and speak after the craziness of Lent, I'm all about it because I've got a pretty free schedule and calendar. So I'm going to be going out and trying to fill that with retreats. And I'm also talking to someone about a conference. Um, pray for me on that. I remember when, let me share something with you. I was with my spiritual director and I was in that five day silent retreat back in November. And I kept I kept hearing God say, I want you to go big. I want you to kind of go on your own, um, like put your own conference together. And I was thinking, how in the world am I going to do that? I don't know how, I don't know the first thing about that. And I was sharing that with my spiritual director and he said, you know what? Maybe God just wants you to sit here when he's ready. Like he wants you to go deeper in your relationship with him. I mean, that five day retreat rocked my world, right? I couldn't, I didn't even want to go back into the world. And I said, okay, I'm just going to let it go. He, I, I know what he told me. And so I kept asking him, do you want me to do it? And he would say, yes, my whoosh feeling. And then it was, do you want me to do it now? Um, I'm sorry. It wasn't, I said, do you want me to do it later? And then the answer was yes, because when I said, do you want me to do it now? I wasn't getting anything. And I started um, going through a moment about a month ago where I was freaking out because I thought he wants me to do this. How am I going to do this? This is a lot of work. And I just, I remember talking to a guy, Brian, and he was like, just be faithful, go back into prayer. And I was like, yeah, yeah. That's what my spiritual director said. I said, God obviously put you in my way today. And then someone just came up to me last week, who guess what? Sets up conferences, does all this stuff. That's what she knows. And she said, God is putting in my heart that we need to do something together. <laughs> So I just have to say prayer is important, silence is important, and using all of the incredible heavenly power of the angels and the archangels and the saints and the holy men and women, your guardian angel, oh, we have so many resources, not just the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, everyone, this week, it's not Lent yet, but go deep with God. Get yourself in a, in a place where you can hear what he wants you to do. Maybe you don't give up chocolate, and instead you give up your time, and you give him your heart, and you go deeper in prayer. That's what he wants. I know it's about penance, but it's hard to give up your time, to put the world out there, right? To shut it down. And to, and to go inward in your relationship with God, go in with the Holy Spirit and say, okay, let's, let's do this together. That's what I want you to focus on this week. That's what I did that last week and holy cow, and I hope I can do a little bit more of it. I think he's asking me though this week to get on that book because the travel starts this weekend. So pray for me if you can. I love you all. God bless you. Have a wonderful and inspired, prayerful week. Take care.